And it was very fortunate also to have a really great cast because this is the most important thing because you alone never can really carry a show like that or do the acting yourself. So I really had a, a brilliant, brilliant cast and Monica was excellent and we really worked well together. So I was very excited about doing that. First of all, guys, I absolutely love FUBAR. It had a little bit of True Lies in there, but it's a, a great action comedy that really at its heart, uh, you know, has, has a great message of family. Um, Arnold, first question for you is, uh, this is your first time doing a scripted television. Um, what was it about FUBAR that drew you in? Well, I think it was just such a brilliant idea uh, to do something, you know, kind of a concept that was comes from a very, very successful movie. Uh, you know, True Lies was one of the biggest hits of the year, uh, directed by Jim Cameron and written by him. And um, so when uh, David Allison came to me with that idea to do a, a, a kind of an action comedy like True Lies, but to do like a whole, um, to do like four episodes, uh, six, no, eight episodes actually, I was very, very excited about that and went all out and uh, and did it. And then it was very fortunate also to have a really great cast because this is the most important thing because you alone never can really carry a show like that or do the acting yourself. So I really had a, a brilliant, brilliant cast and Monica was excellent and we really worked well together. So I was very excited about doing that. Absolutely. Now, Monica, can you talk about the father-daughter relationship in FUBAR? Because it, uh, it taps into real issues father and daughters uh, face, especially when they grow up. I love that this story is just a father and daughter working out all of their issues, but in the setting of, you know, also trying to save the world. I think that just lends itself to a beautiful comedic tone that Nick Santora wrote so well. Um, and we had a lot of fun with that. We just have, we give each other a hard time. So it makes it nice and easy to, <laughs> to have that like father-daughter chemistry on set. Arnold, like you said, your cast is brilliant. Uh, Monica does a tremendous job as your daughter, Emma. What does she bring to the role that wasn't necessarily on the page? Well, I think there was a lot on the page. So I think that she did exactly what was in the page. And then every actor or actress brings their own little quality to that whole thing. And I think the reason why they chose uh, Monica is because she has proven to be a very, very good actress. She has, was fantastic in Top Gun, when uh, you know, which became the most successful movie of that year and one of the most successful movies of all time. So this is really unbelievable to have someone carry a, a, a Tom, of course, is the star in it, but I mean, she was the one that kind of almost stole the show there. And so she just really was shining all the way through that movie. And so when I heard that she's signing on to do this uh, TV series, I was very excited about that because she was spectacular in that. And, uh, you know, to to have someone like her be that good with action, you know, so that to me was really important. And so, and when she came to the set, she really worked well with the stunt coordinators and with the stunt people and did a fantastic job in doing all of her, her action and stuff like that. I couldn't agree with you more. And also Top Gun was one of my favorite movies last year. Uh, Monica, a question I have for you is you got to fly, fly planes with Tom Cruise. You did action sequences with Arnold Schwarzenegger. Is there anything left on your filmography bucket list that you'd like to check off? Oh my God. I mean, so many things. I'm really just lucky that, I mean, I've been doing this for a long time, but also I always feel like I'm just starting out. I feel like I'm pinching myself every day, like getting to go and do a whole award circuit this year was just like mind blowing and meeting so many heroes of mine was just incredible and getting to work with them. I mean, it's just, it's been a blast. I'm just like trying to stay present and stay open to whatever's next. Well, look, I can't wait for people to see the show on the 25th. Amazing job. I absolutely loved it. Thank you so much for your time, guys. Thank I appreciate you. it. Thank you. Bye.